all the townships and all the tourist attractions along 75 mile beach have been made into 40 kilometer an hour areas so just be very aware of these signs they have one sign letting you know that there's a 40k zone coming up and then you'll get to the 40k zone definitely do 40k's an hour because in a 40k zone one kilometer over and they can give you a ticket and the police during peak times do set speed traps up through there to stop people speeding in these areas um, only because there's a lot of people a lot of children um, especially in front of the the Mahino wreck at Eli Creek and places like that there's just a huge number of people and that we you cannot speed through those areas the speed limit is 80 kilometers an hour on the rest of the beach unless otherwise signed when the beach is really flat you feel as though you could do 100 along the beach no problem at all but the main reason they enforce the 80 k's an hour speed limit is because we're all running 18 psi in our tires and our tires are quite soft so sitting on the lower speed definitely makes it a lot safer Yeah, when we're on the island enjoying the island always make sure you've got a designated driver don't feel as though we're in a remote area and we can drink drive because they quite often do set up um, breathalyzer traps i suppose you'd call them where if you they'll pull every vehicle over and everyone will have to blow in the bag and unfortunately a lot of people you know end up going just over the legal limit because they've had a few beers so just be aware of that don't have your beer until you get to the destination or have a designated driver. It's just as simple as that. We can't drink drive on the island. Thanks for watching our videos. If you're wanting more information on about Fraser and traveling the beaches and enjoying all the beautiful things to see over there, we have a YouTube channel that you can subscribe to, All About Fraser. And on there, there's a collection of videos that you can watch and go through. And there's you'll pick up a huge amount of knowledge watching the videos. So when you get there, it won't feel like the first time at all.